We will be recreating a Rob the Bank type style video for you guys. It's a really great style. It's smooth, simplistic, aesthetic, everything you want, especially in your personal brand. My name is Editing Torson. I've helped 1,700 creators. I sell digital assets online to basically 100x your editing speed, but without further ado, let's get straight into this video. As you've seen, this is the video we have created. Right now, you can see that there is some text. So what we wanna do over on my blank sheet over here, I'm going to go up to captions hit create captions this is going to create all these captions for us so we get a nice base start and know what we want as the final product i always put this minimum length at 10 hit single create captions it's going to do an amazing job for us you can see on the top we have our captions highlight all of them by just left cl clicking and dragging them and this is the fun part go over to your essential graphics and if you guys don't have that go up to the windows and hit essential graphics right there. What he does at the start of the video or what I do at the start of the video based off of his video is he just has plain text hit with a kind of like cropped view with numbers glowing and this just like VHS effect that it looks pretty cool. Let's first start off with these captions. So make sure you have them all highlighted and we're gonna just center him because in the video I have right now, he's perfectly aligned and his cameraman is doing an awesome job, whoever it is, it's probably just Tribod. <laughs> but it's doing pretty well. I wanna highlight him, I'm gonna click this, I'm gonna go to the font that I'm going to be using that's similar to his is Monastrate or whatever it's called. I'm just gonna go to black. It's gonna give us this nice black. He doesn't use a shadow. Yeah, he does. He uses barely a shadow, so let's just up this a ton. Look to the shadow, I'm gonna put that, just mess around. Oh, that looks pretty good. Yeah, let's just use that. Awesome, now we have the shadow, and it looks like some of these are kind of not right, so I just click it, grab over to the right side, and drag it. And let's just decrease the size just a little bit. There we go. Awesome. So I have this hit kind of in this viral text effect. So if you guys go into and download all those free sample effects that I've given you, this will be in it. So you can just follow along. Let's highlight all of these, go up to your graphics and titles, and let's upgrade them, upgrade them to caption to graphic. So it's gonna bring them all the way up here. Just bring this all the way down because we want to see it. And just increase the size by clicking, going to your graphics tab and increase this. Go over to that viral sample pack I've given you. So it should look like, this is what it looks like. Go into the viral text animations and grab the viral text sample effect. And boom, now you have that effect that he uses in a lot of his videos and other people use that's been extremely popular lately. And then I hit with a million and cut to that. So also in the link in the description, you will find this free overlay that I have customly made for you guys. So definitely check that out. So it looks like that, nice. I'm gonna grab that B-roll also. Okay, it's starting to look really nice too. So for the stripe effect, I want you to look up this venetation blinds in your search bar, it'll come up. Put the direction at 90. It's gonna give that flat. And let's increase this to about, I'd say 40. Give it a little feathering. Let's go 20 feather. Yeah, now look, it gives that the nice kind of vintage VHS look that he has made. He makes our, I made a 1 million sign like he did in his video. So I'm just gonna do, I'm gonna bring the text tool. We're gonna do dollar sign, one million with commas. And in his video, he did a kind of like royal font. So the royal font I used was this Bondia 72. I put it to bold, gives us a nice, and just go here and give it a green look. He doesn't use a shadow. 
put this in the center just like that make it bigger and his is really stretched out so go over to your effects control vector motion uncheck uniform scale and let's just drag this height up a lot and this width like close oh yeah that looks great gives it a nice really good glow so i'm just gonna go over to my effects tab just search up gaussian blur and first duplicate it then grab the gaussian blur and put on the lower one and let's crank this gaussian blur like crazy so the first one gives that that nice duplicate this one again and let's crank the gaussian blur more but then decrease the opacity awesome now you get a great looking picture just like that now let's just highlight all of these right click and nest it oh that's even looking better now we have that, he gives it a little tilt. So I just searched up 3D, basic 3D, grab that layer and grab this bottom one and tilt it just slightly upwards like that. Awesome. Fourth month, he says fourth month. So again, just grab both of the fourth month and stretch it just like that. And we are going to resize them. So put it to like, I'd say 90, yep. And just like the other one, let's give it the same font. Awesome. Now let's put this in the bottom left or bottom right. Make room and let's see the month. Do the exact same thing. Bold. There we go. And we did 90. Put this in the bottom right as well. And let's make it yellow. Just by clicking it, going down to your appearance, hit fill and just grab a yellow. You want the same yellow to be the same. So grab this color picker and just grab, touch the other one, and boom. Now you have an effect just like him. But you might be thinking, well, where's the slide effect that he made? Well, that's really easy to make. Let's just search up crop, crop effect, drag it onto your layer, and what you wanna do, oh my God. Let's go down to the crop effect, click on the crop effect so you can see it, you see how this, we are going to grab the right side and drag it all the way to the left. Click on the right position key, go a few frames forward, click crop again, and bring it all the way to the right. And it should now give you a really cool, like that. Highlight all of them, right click, ease in to get it in a better kind of way. And you have that exact same effect that he has. Boom, just like that. What I did for the business is I easily just, I popped it, made it bigger like so. And again, just searched up, search up that viral text effect that I give you. It looks exactly like that. Now, how did I make the 400 plus? Well, that's also super simple. <laughs> it's just, so I have all of mine lined up. Make sure you just line them up perfectly the way it should be. 400 plus that. So again, he does a that same font style. So just highlight them all, go scroll all the way up, find that one again, hit that, and actually highlight them again so we get that yellow color that we saw earlier. He doesn't use a shadow on these. Plus. So let's just line them up by grabbing this, enhancing it, and putting it in the top left. Plus, let's go up to the top left make it bigger. It doesn't really matter if they're the same size or not. People actually kind of like it when each one is different sized. I put the thousand as I just switched the textile. So go back to that one I showed you, make it, it doesn't matter what color it is and grab that viral again, make it huge so it really stands out. Something like that. Oh yeah, that looks really good. It's thousand. And grab this down here once again size it so you get something just like this plus thousand profit. that's awesome we're getting close to the end which finally because all these animations are just really annoying to make over and over and over again 400 plus thousand profit we're not even running ads it's and i just grabbed some b-roll like you can see grab some b-roll and resize this by just clicking on it getting the super and resizing this to as big as you possibly can. Same with the viral, but also to emphasize the viral, size it and add that viral text effect I gave you. 
And just throughout the entire video, make sure just to keep adding B-roll. But if you guys just want to not like really want to edit at all and just have it all laid out for you for a system like his editing that actually works and it's proven, let me show you how to copy and paste in editing styles just like this. So you just simply just go over here. You can see that there's already made plans for you. Like this is already done for you and this, but his style is more of this one right here. So what I did, I just grabbed, you can grab this, bring it over, drop it, already made for you. It's that simple, sound effects are already done. Just drop it, see I already did it all and you get an effect just well, like this. It's not just that one part though. You have an entire 30 second, 15 to 30 second already laid out editing for you. So it's a really big time saver. And if you wanna learn more and edit better, check out this video right over here. Thank you for watching, peace.